In the video where I was talking about the new TV station event, I said that I wouldn't play this map. I explained that it's nightmare, it's hell, it's waste of inventory. And then guess what happened? I wanted to continue my weapon review, let's say series, because I did the Deagle, the M14, the S12K, and now I was going after the AKS-74U. I think that's, that's the name, like the small brother uh, or small sister of the big guns and my kid sequel asked if i'm up to some games and he wanted to play tv station and i was like oh my god no i i, I don't want to do it because i'm you know we're just gonna lose stuff so i dressed up into t3 and this aks 74 i'm gonna call it aks 74 without the u at the end so i i picked it up and guess what happened guess what happened we played five games and I survived the map five times in a row. And actually, I had my best moment ever in one of the games. There was a full squad and there was even a bot and we already lost the game and, and I killed them. I was so surprised. You're gonna see that in the video at one point. But anyways, so I wanted this to be like a weapon review type of thing and um, and TV station felt to be like an okay place to try it out. And if you remember, in the armory rush mode, we had this gun uh, in the basic equipment. So this AKS-74, and I liked that back then. So whenever I got that gun, th then I always picked that loadout. And I think it performed pretty well. I wasn't sure if I can do any kills with this TV station because obviously I didn't go with like a high-end ammunition. I picked up T3 ammunition, the purple one, and 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 it just happened. In the first game I got a Scarrel and then an FAL and then all kind of stuff. I was overwhelmed with loot by running this gun, but it doesn't necessarily mean that this is a good gun. By default it wouldn't mean that, but I still feel that this is a pretty decent gun. So for the price, which is approximately 23-ish thousand, if you go with a 1x scope, then this is something that actually looks good. It's somewhere in between an SMG and an assault rifle. So the firing rate is okay and it's a, like a mid-ranged gun. We shouldn't expect it to be as good as an FAL or M4 or whatever. But I think if I had to compare it with the MP5, then I think it's like pretty close. You could actually grab this gun and try it out in SMG mode where you try to get close and then quickly like burst the enemy. I think it works especially with the 60 round mag because we have a 60 round magazine for this gun and then if you have a spare one in your rig then it's 120 bullets and then that should be perfectly enough. And not to mention that the gun actually looks cool if you remove all of the brown parts then you can make it full black and then it's like, yeah, it, it's it's a good one. I like it. I like it personally. I also talked about this with Zequel. He likes it as well. So compared to many other guns we have in the game, this is actually one that is worth trying. So the return of investment, and when I say that, you invest some money and what you get for it, return of investment or ROI, um, is pretty high for the gun because the gun is very cheap and the overall value of the gun is competing with the Scarrel, with the AKM, with the MP5. I'm not saying it's better, but it's just a tiny bit behind. You can perform very well with this gun, as you can see on screen. I, if I could do it, then you can do it as well. So as a summary, I could say that this gun brought me luck because I extracted five times in a row on the new TV station event map which is actually surprising. In case you decide to try this weapon build, then definitely leave me feedback whether it worked for you or not. Maybe maybe I was just lucky, but, but I don't think so. With a very trash gun, I cannot perform like I did with this gun. And also give me feedback on what should be the next weapon. What's the weapon, what's the build you want me to try out? And then I think I'm gonna do three games and regardless whether if I win or lose, I'm gonna give you like a summary of what happened, what was the overall loot value, and uh, basically share my opinion about the build or the gun itself. Thank you for your attention. Happy hunting, folks. Shoot, loot, subscribe. Shady out. Bye.